don't ask Israel to jump into the cage after he's been on the whiskeys or the bourbons. Like, <laughs> that's just dumb. I wouldn't get him to walk my dog after he's been on the bourbons or whiskeys, you know? I wouldn't get him to walk my dog to the litter box. What you just heard was Eugene Behrman suggests that Israel Adesanya is not trustworthy around dogs when he's inebriated. Did Izzy's own head coach just expose him for being sus with man's best friend? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Shout out Southern Cross Combat. That's the channel where I got the footage of Eugene Behrman from this interview. And also shout out Primetime Feline, a longtime viewer of my channel, who actually sent me this on Instagram. If you ever have any news or any uh, memes or anything you want to send me, you can do that on Instagram at MMA.Rigo. I appreciate a follow on there, even if you don't have anything to send me. And... For those of you who don't know, the first documentary video essay, anything I ever made besides a prediction video with my face in it, was the Willie Time documentary. I'm the guy who brought you the original news about Izzy laying in bed, flicking the Willie around with his dog. That got picked up by bigger MMA channels, who then got that information into Sean Strickland's hands, who talked about it in his press conference and the build-up to his fight with Israel Adesanya, and then beat Israel Adesanya, and basically made this dog-Izzy relationship thing mainstream news. While all this news was breaking, Izzy was also found to be following this weird, like, dog-girl Jenna furry page on Twitter or X, whatever you like to call it. And then he kind of doubled down on the sus behavior going like, I made that B, C. I can't even really say it in the video. It's crazy degenerate stuff. But then he kind of like backtracked and was like crying after losing the Strickland and in his ear going like, please don't talk about my dog. It's my best friend. You don't understand my situation. It's like uh, everyone understands what it's like to have a dog. Like everyone knows what it's like to have a dog, dude. Chill. So anyway, in the most recent clip from the Southern Cross Combat, Eugene Behrman is asked by the interviewer, what do you think about Izzy hopping into the cage when he confronted Drickus uh, after UFC 297, speaking of Sean Strickland, after Drickus beat Sean Strickland in Canada? And Izzy uh, was like, everyone knows, like, he was like out of his mind. He was yelling like 36 in me, 26 in me stuff. He was yelling the N- N-word Maxine uh, that day. All sorts of stuff, uh, getting up in uh, Drickus's face, telling him to feel him and stuff. Eugene was, is just like, nah, I think that was just weird. I couldn't understand the whole thing. I thought it was just weird, mate. I, was just, I, I saw um, little clips of that. I was like, mate, what is going on? Uh, it just looked, it was just weird. Like, but you can tell he's not shocked. Like, he's like, I saw some clips of it. I wasn't there, but you know, it was weird. But he's like, well, they're stupid for inviting Izzy into the octagon when he's off the bourbons. How I looked at that was, um, my old mate just had one too many bourbons. And then, yeah, don't, don't ask Israel to jump into the cage after he's been on the whiskeys or the bourbons. Like, <laughs> that's just dumb. Eugene knows his boy, Izzy, is a wild, reckless, irresponsible drunk. We all know he's whipping the McLaren around <laughs> off the bourbons in New Zealand. I wouldn't get him to walk my dog after he's being on the bourbons or whiskeys, you know? I wouldn't get him to walk my dog to the litter box. He's reckless and irresponsible, and Eugene knows that. He's not shocked, but he goes on to say, offhandedly, I wouldn't even trust Izzy to walk my dog when he's off the bourbons. And that's a damning little joke because there's always a bit of truth in jest, and we can see here Izzy off some beers winding up on his dog. This was in my original documentary, the Willie Tom documentary, as supporting evidence. This is crazy. He's He likes dancing with dogs. He likes getting hips real close to that dog and dancing with them. So, And that's his, like, day drinking Izzy. So I could not imagine nighttime Izzy off the bourbons. Yeah, don't let him near your uh, Doberman or your Rottweiler or your Chihuahua, God forbid. Hey, I'm looking at you, Alexa Grasso. That Chihuahua doesn't want you to kiss it. All right? In the thumbnail, stop. 
I wouldn't get him to walk my dog after he's been on the bourbons or whiskeys, you know? I wouldn't get him to walk my dog to the letterbox. Eugene says this twice, actually. He uses the dog as an example twice. He says, I wouldn't let Izzy take my dog for a walk. That'd be stupid. And he also says, I wouldn't let him walk my dog to the litter box. So I'm not sure if actually this might not confirm anything about the dogs because Eugene might be confusing dogs with cats. I wouldn't get him to walk my dog to the litter box. Uh, dogs don't use litter boxes, at least not in the uh, uh, civilized world. I don't know what they're doing down in New Zealand walking their dog to a litter box. Wouldn't a litter box just be something you let your dog go do it by itself anyway? That's the whole point of them. So, okay, weird. I think he might be talking about cats. Eugene might... Something might be going on up here with Eugene. We can see how he talks. I wouldn't get him to walk my dog to the litter box. To the litter box. But regardless, even if he is talking about dogs, he obviously probably is talking about dogs. Um, it's just weird he said the litter box thing. This isn't actually, guys, like, pull back. It's very funny, and Izzy's definitely sus with dogs. But I made the video in the first place. But to get too serious about it, I would caution you on, because Eugene used this as an offhand comment. He was using it as an example. It's like saying I wouldn't let Izzy wash the dishes or mow my lawn when he's off the bourbons, right? Now, it's maybe a little bit telling he chose dog and not another common expression, but our common, you know, comparison he could have made. But at the end of the day, what this clip really does confirm for us is Izzy is a wild, reckless, irresponsible drunk who Eugene has not surprised at all by his behavior of getting into the octagon and yelling slurs and all sorts of crazy stuff and being aggressive because he, as he says, wouldn't trust them with the simplest of tasks, walking a dog. Yeah, my African brother. Yeah, my African brother. What's up, if you enjoyed the video and the little bit of news, breaking news, I'm going to start doing more like this. So drop a like on the video, subscribe if you're new, and uh, turn the bell notification on so you don't miss a single thing. So the Pharisees are on me. They're behind me. They're throwing stones at me right now. We got to dip. We got to get out of here right now. Demon possessed man on my right. I'm praying over him right now. He's cracked. He's cracked. I'd like to give my channel members a big thank you. Without you guys, the channel would not be possible. And a special thanks to my Lion Tier members. I appreciate each and every one of you. Now they make it seem like we just so bad, so dangerous. They make it seem like we monsters. We just like normal people. We just be chilling, really. Look, for them over there laughing around, playing. Demon Bobby. Demon Mommy.